Welcome back. Spring brings all kinds of delights. This year, one of them is coming from the East Hampton Public Library. It's a new program called May We See Your Dog. <laughs> NBC Connecticut's Jane Caffrey shows us how this dog lovers initiative is trying to get people back to the public library. The East Hampton Public Library is spreading positivity this month. It's a lot of fun. Everybody loves the dogs these days. Launching a new program this May called May We See Your Dog. We are forgiving the fee for one lost or damaged item per patron um, in exchange for a dog photo. A spinoff of the Wooster Public Library's March Meowness. They shared the story on social media and then within a few days I just was hearing about it everywhere. Although the library doesn't have late fees, there is a charge for a damaged item that will now be waived if you email or bring in a photo of a dog for display on a pet community board. I just kept thinking it was such a wonderful way to bring patrons back to the library who might feel like they can't come and enjoy our services because they owe us for a book or a DVD or something that got damaged. About 300 patrons could benefit. And while you're invited to snap a photo of your own fur friend, you don't need a dog of your own to get in on the action. You could bring in a photo of a friend's dog, a neighbor's dog, a cute dog you saw online, you could draw us a picture of a dog. We really want to make it something that everybody can take advantage of. Returning to the library means people can enjoy a variety of programs and even rent out non-traditional items like paddle boards. Susan yes, Markham knows the yes, value of her public library well coming here. Geez, almost, almost five days a week. She hopes the dog-loving idea will get legs. I think it's fantastic because it then brings back the books and it also brings back the patrons who are kind of a little leery about coming back in. And I think it's a wonderful opportunity to research the library. For NBC Connecticut News, I'm Jane Caffrey. Now, your NBC Connecticut Storm Tracker forecast with Chief Meteorologist Ryan Hanrahan. Well, it was overcast for most of the day in southeastern Connecticut, but the sun is out now and it's looking pretty good here in 